as a young Indian, what I want from the budget is an actualization of a business friendly India. For ease of doing business to translate into ground reality, we need the harassment to taxpayers and to reduce and simplification of the existing tax laws. We had several amendments which did not achieve the intended consequences. The income computation and disclosure standards have ended up unsettling the settled laws laid down by our honorable courts several decades ago. The concepts of capital versus revenue or the timing of recognition of income have all been turned around. This will not help the taxpayers. It will only lead to additional litigation. Also, amendments such as the range concept or the multiple year data for transfer pricing will also increase the litigation quotient. Multiple year data has the potential to entirely change the set of comparables that the taxpayer adopts at the time of audit versus what will be adopted at the time of the assessment. Not only that, a taxpayer eligible for range concept might become ineligible later or vice versa. This will only cause harassment to the taxpayer. The GAR also, as it stands today, has the potential to treat any taxpayer as guilty until proven innocent. This is not in spirit with the Indian law or the Indian legal system to ensure that businesses are done with some ease in India, this needs to be reduced. It needs to be either watered down or done away with in the present scenario where we have ample anti-avoidance measures in the Indian law. And finally, we have become a compliance large where every business today has to do some or the other tax reporting of similar or same figures every month or every fortnight. This does not help in doing business. A reduction in the amount of compliances will definitely help people concentrate on their businesses and in turn contribute to the tax revenue.